Hello everyone, welcome back to Planet Zoo. Bear with me, the game's running a little slow today. At least it, fe it feels like it's, I'm not really sure why. Um, maybe the whole like is connected to the internet thing, my internet's just slow today, but I'm not positive. Is my internet's, I'm, I'm wired in, so. At this point, we're just going to kind of go with it. Though I'd like to get more than 16 frames per second game. Yeah, would that be good? Yeah, that'd be great. Are you going to do it? No. Now, I'm a little sick, so I'm going to keep this one a little short today. But where we were last time, we were about to start the alligator enclosures. Now, to do that, we need to go to facilities here, go to utilities, transformer. Sorry. A bit like that. <laughs> now what I want to do is it'll run parallel to this walkway here, but then I'm going to put a hedge up. Kind of keep the uh, atmosphere like there's no real maintenance going on in the background back here. So we go to the hedge. I'll have like another habitat right here, and it'll kind of the hedge will kind of blend into that. Yeah, that looks good. I think I'm gonna make this short grass. Yes, I mean, like, the, the, I don't know why the game's chugging like this right now. There's absolutely no reason it should be doing this. Yeah, I don't know why it's doing that, and it's very irritating. Because it was running fine earlier this week, and I was just kind of, at, like, you know, placing trees down. Oh, yeah, I made a new habitat center, or, like, some couple more habitats in here. Got ourselves some uh, snakes now, eastern brown snakes. There are quite a few of them, actually. And the group size, it looks like the group size is too large. So. Oh, looks like we've got maturing timber. Well, that's good. How old are you? But yeah, so we've uh, just doing a little bit of maintenance because uh, one of the things you've got to make sure is that you keep your exhibits uh, only at a certain level of animals per. That way, you know, they don't get unhappy. And as you can see, there are uh, just a couple of scorpions in here, not many. Um, and how are our spiders doing? Oh, you can see one. I've never been able to see them before. That's great. Oh, are there too many? Yeah, too many. Okay. Oh yeah, there are a lot in here. Uh, one.
I think Mercedes. Yeah, we'll go with Mercedes. Still too many. Um, maybe Ricardo. Who's like one of the older ones? Is oh, you're silver. Mm. I do not need to look at that. I need to look at these. We're trying to figure out which like which animal to get rid of. Violina. That should be good. We have new research into the grizzly bear and the Easter brown snake. Very nice. Oh yeah, I got another vet researcher too. Uh, now let's see here. If I go to... Oh, yeah, I also have some Nile monitors for us to uh, put in at some point. I can't, I can't, I can't stop buying them. Just so cool. Trade away those animals. I want to release them, but it wasn't only me, but you know, I need to free up this first base. However, I go to here. Can I release the armadillo to the wild? The aardvark. There we go. Now I go to social near the top of our adult population. Hmm. All right. Well, uh, we'll see what happens. Still pretty fertile, so I, I'd hope we can get a couple more pups out of them. If we go over the aardvark closure. Alright, now with that all kind of checked out, let's go ahead and get in our animals. Alright. And now that I've finished sneezing, let's get to uh, our new animals. I said, let's get to our animals. Ah, and now that I finished sneezing, let's see here. I need habitat. No, uh, facilities.
Okay. Have a couple donation boxes. This is how this part keeps running. And we'll do a couple benches too, so people can kind of watch the uh, the majestic saltwater crocodiles. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, zookeepers. Yep. Oh, they are big boys. Got ourselves some big boys here. They're two stars now. We got good exhibit species welfare. Cool. We're doing well. Doing well. Oh no, we lost the timber wolf. It died. Oh no. Oh, that's so sad. Well, there she was in the old stage of her life, though. So there's that. Hmm. I think we need a new wolf. Because, and here's my reasoning for this, uh, we need to be able to keep procreating these guys. Because we didn't get any males so that we can't continue the lineage. Which is less than fortunate. I need a mail. Uh, I'll let their pop one up in the market. Dang it. Well, oh, something for me to keep in mind. Maybe I'll just pop back real quick. Take a look. Yep. Oh, sure, they'll pop up someday. But anyways, while we're uh, over here, let's go ahead and take a look at... Yeah, you guys need water. What kind of water? Just water? I don't know why it's acting up like this. This is very irritating. But maybe with some update they pushed out that they didn't really consider all the way. More water? Okay.
can see like <sighs> trying to raise so it's like a smooth enough curve that they can come out this side too. There we go. Oh my god, another offspring. Okay. And now we need we need uh we need some more short grass. There we go. go to nature and we get a tropical Okay, what kind of are you guys from again? Oh, no. There we go. Just kind of spruce up the zoo a little bit. Oh, one of these is a lot bigger. Either, yeah, okay. Crocodile enclosure. All right, we'll get a. Uh... Nope, never mind. 
Hire someone now. Enclosure. Oh, and uh, before we go, we're going to get a food thing set up. Oh, uh, where is it? Okay, and we're good. That's that's our crocodile enclosure done. And just oh, it's coming together. It's starting to come together. And I like it a lot. I like where this is going. But uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Adios.